were there documenting everything that was going on so that John's story could be told and so we could pay our respects. So this book return right here is the exact spot they were, they agreed to meet to exchange the children. So we built a little memorial here. Um, so no, I haven't gotten to see my kids. John's family what it was like seeing him go through these false allegations and if they thought for one second he could do the things he was accused of. Accusations, they were horrific. There were allegations um, started with domestic violence allegations. Those didn't stick. He was exonerated of those. And then it went into sexual allegations. First from the daughter, he was exonerated of that. And it also went to uh, then also to the son. My brother John was exonerated on all charges. I think he felt shame that he would be even named as such. He, w he wasn't just fighting against uh, the mother of the children, but he was also fighting the family court, the family law system. The court ruled in his favor and said the motion was denied by the mother. You get to see the children at six that evening. So he called me. He said, I want, I want this motion. I get to see the kids. I was here to be with him when we got word that he gets to pick up his children for the first time that evening, unsupervised for parenting time. It was supposed to start at six o'clock on Friday night. He then I saw a car that. pulling up that belonged to his ex-wife. When he turned around, John was met by his ex-father-in-law, Jim Brashear, who says, hi, John, and then proceeded to shoot him three times. This was the scene Friday night, February 5th, moments after 6 o'clock. This is where investigators say James Brashear fatally shot his daughter's ex-husband, John Mast. Police say Mast was shot three times. Mast was taken to St. Joseph Regional Medical Center, where he later died. Reporting from the newsroom, Justin Spinney. Came. John Mast lost his life fighting for his children. While his life may have been murdered, his fight just experienced a new birth.